441, let's get a check of your weather authority forecast. I'm meteorologist Molly McCout. We're starting off on the muggy side yet again. Here's the difference between today and all the other hot and humid days that we've had this week. We might get some rain today and we need it. We are in a moderate drought in some places in central New York. Syracuse Airport is over two inches shy of where it should be rain wise. You can see on Triple Doppler brought to you by Cayuga Community College. There is a line of some light showers trying to make their way into central New York. This actually isn't what we're tracking. This is a cold front well off to the west. This doesn't even get close to central New York until overnight Friday into Saturday. Before then, we have a humid flow out of the south that will get some isolated pop up showers and storms going today. So no widespread rain, but where isolated cells do form, we could see some heavy downpours and that is great news up into the North Country through central New York and the Finger Lakes where a moderate drought is now in effect. I'll time it out for you hour by hour with the future cast morning commute. Not a whole lot to worry about. Still very humid. Temperatures will likely be back into the upper 70s in no time. Then as we start to tap into some heat and moisture, I would say afternoon all bets are off. We could see some isolated showers starting to pop up, but look at how quickly they form together and intensify. If it starts to rain very soon after, as these storms head from the southwest to the northeast, we could get into some moderate to heavy rainfall. And you can see most of this now Futurecast is putting at Syracuse and south. I think all of the viewing areas should be weather aware and keep an eye on the radar if you are trying to get out this afternoon because some of these showers and storms could be a little bit strong and we're keeping an eye on the threat for some damaging winds both this afternoon and also early Saturday. That's when that front moves through widespread rain in the morning, tapering to isolated showers and storms, which could still be strong on Wednesday after or Saturday afternoon. Sunday, cooler, breezy, comfortable, 78, nice and dry for Monday, Tuesday, and most of Wednesday before we turn unsettled and hot.